Morning, friends. Have you ever seen one of those things uh, on your phone that said uh, you could get free Milwaukee tools? Have you ever filled that thing out? Seen what happens? <laughs> I seen one last night. I filled it out. You know. Put in some of my information, of course, and then it, then it turned into this and turned into that, and then I started getting notifications through my Chrome app, uh, telling me that uh, my account have uh, my information been compromised and uh, going to be shut down, and on and on and on, and uh, want me to get this, want me to get that to unlock my telephone and uh, anyways I don't think I'm going to get no free tools out of it I had to go to Chrome map and uh, turn my notifications off it's 730 here in North Georgia in the eastern part of the United States what time is it at your house? Uh, praise God, my sister Ann got a got a good report. She's cancer free, and I'd like to thank all of you that have prayed for my sister. God bless you. We got up. And, uh, we got a lot of pain in our body. It's, apparently, it's going to rain here in a few days. Something's going on. Uh, Got a pollinator or two over there, buzzing around. Got a lot of pain in my body. I didn't rest good last night either. I see Nugget and Cricket up there at the barn. Yeah, we hit, we, uh, we had some breakfast about one o'clock last night, and uh, we've uh, flipped and flopped and suffered and struggled the rest of the night. And so I had a couple of canned biscuits and uh, some of that powder and gravy that Sister Darlene sent me. Pioneer uh, sausage flavored powder and gravy. Mix it with mix it with a little water and stir it up and heat it up. It sure is good. The sun is coming up, coming out. I'd get out before now sometimes, but I don't want to get run over in the dark. I guess I got to hold a flashlight in one hand and telephone in the other. Anyways, praise God for my sister. She's suffered with that stuff for quite a while. She had two or three surgeries. She had her tonsils took out. She had some lymph nodes took out. She had some other surgeries along the way. Uh, spine, spinal fusion. And uh, when she had her tonsils took out, I think it was, they done two surgeries at one time. Looked like her neck had been cut open with a chainsaw. Ain't it pretty? Anyways, we're glad to be alive today. On May 30th, I quit smoking cigarettes at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Praise God for that. I took a bath the night before last, <laughs> a shower. And this morning I have shaved. <laughs> I don't shave real close. I don't shave, a, you know, a, not smooching and kissing close anyways. <laughs> but it gets it off my face and makes me look a little better to myself.
you know, back in the day. I don't reckon anybody used to shave or cut their hair. You'll see all the pictures of Jesus and the rest of them. Well, not in all the movies, but that's the way I've seen most of them. Long hair and uh, beard and mustache. I got a picture of Jesus on my wall that belonged to my brother-in-law's mother. Jesus has got blue eyes, but I'd say for the country that he was raised, born and raised in. He probably had brown eyes. He might not have. Here comes another car. I hope they see me. That's my neighbor has got all the dogs. She's got a tail light out, a brake light out. Some young cop that uh, ain't been working too long on the job, uh, he'll get her for that. State Patrol was showing enough to get her. Uh, there was a cop at Dawsonville one time. <laughs> he worked in the jail for a long, long time. And uh, worked at the desk, the booking desk, and pat and search and uh, book in and make pictures and lock them up. And he wanted to go to the road so bad and uh, be a real police. And uh, <laughs> he finally made it. But he didn't last long. He'd be down here at the roundabout. Uh, uh, close to Georgia 400, roundabout over our car wash. And uh, it was the first roundabout I remember being in Dauphin County. And uh, there's a lot of traffic in that area, being it was close to, to the mall. The mall. And. Uh, <laughs> So, uh, people going through that roundabout and, uh, not stopping and doing this and doing that. Anyways, he, he had that thing on stakeout. <laughs> and, uh, he's, call, he's calling in every few minutes. Somebody's tag number and pulling somebody over. And, uh, it didn't take long. They took him off the road. <laughs> he's writing tickets to everybody. Come along. <laughs> Needless to say, he's working in the court system now. <laughs> what he was the last time I encountered him. Praise God, I don't have to encounter him anymore. Look at all them fuzzy, fuzzy things are growing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I seen a thing said you, I could get free Milwaukee tools. And it asked about me being between a certain age, and I should have called on in and uh, filled out some questions about using Milwaukee tools and had it purchased any lately and so on. And wanted my information, my address, where to send them to. And, and then it said something about completing this survey before I could get them. And, uh, I started filling that out. And then. One thing led to another. It had trust pilot on iron. It had something about VPNs and it had something about telephone being compromised and uh, needed to purchase this and uh, phones gonna be locked down and uh, PayPal and I don't know what all else on there. Uh, money bit, but money's been deposited in your account and. On and on and on. I tell you what, it was aimed. It was aimed at. It was directed at older, older men, being it was tools and being it had something to do with age.
the little white cat. I give her tuna a time or two, and now she don't want to eat cat food. So uh, we're gonna hold off on the tuna today. We'll see what happens about the tools, but I don't expect anything to happen. Seems like everyone there said that you had to complete this survey. And the notifications are coming through the chrome out. I've got a tablet and I've got a phone. They weren't coming to my phone, but apparently the notifications have been turned off in my phone. I come to my tablet, which that's the place I filled out the application. See if I can get the tools. Anyways, it's a great day. We're going to go in here and uh, read our devotion. The muscadines are falling from the trees, from the vines. They're all in the ditch. They're all in the road. Squirrels eat them things and pop them open. We got our Bible reference from uh, Sister Darlene yesterday. And <clears throat> Excuse me. No mail. We got a. Uh, we got some linseed oil and some uh, tools to uh, spread paint with. Uh, not all paintings, uh, not all parts of a painting are done with a paintbrush. Sometimes they're done with a, I can't think of the name of it. Anyways, we got our odorless uh, paint thinner from uh, Walmart. I think we're to the point all we need to do is get it all out and set it up and try it. Hello little white cat. I put her in that cardboard box this morning. Let her sit there. I put a I put a great video of a pregnant cat and uh, somebody's journey on helping her have kittens. I think she's living in a parking deck, deck and uh, the people give her food and fixed her box to have her babies in and the box kept getting thrown away and this and that, but she ended, she was, she was really fat. She was a beautiful cat though. She finally gave birth to them after two or three trips to the vet and having them uh, pictures made to see if she was, was like capable of giving birth and pictures of how many there was in there and so on. It's on my community post. There's lots of stuff on my community post. <laughs> oh, man. I went to my music, music to my soul playlist last night and played some of my rock and roll. There's a bass speaker in there. It's connected to the TV. I turn it on and it adds some bass. Little orange cat, he's, he's stalking a white cat. <laughs> That bowl was full of food a while ago, so somebody ate it. I don't know which one. I don't know where little Tom is. Somebody's been up here on the porch and eating. <laughs> that was that was a lot fuller when I left. Leave her alone while she's using the bathroom. 
little orange cat. Father in heaven, have mercy on me. Forgive me of my sin. Thank you for my blessings, God. Thank you, Jesus, for saving my soul. Please bless my friends and family, my neighbors and our animals. Guard us and protect us and keep us safe and well. Today we pray in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Leave her alone, little orange cat. Y'all see that video of that cat? It's in my community post. Some community posts scroll up and down. Some of them scroll sideways. But when you go to my channel in there, you'll have to move all the way over to the right to find community posts. Click on it. And the way it is for me, it scrolls up and down after, after I click on community posts. But I have seen them where you, where you scroll sideways. I think that's according to your settings or what kind of device you're using. Anyways, God bless you, friends. It's our first walk of the day. We done took our medicine. There's a box I set her in this morning. She sat in it for a while before she ever got out. But she's well capable of getting over the sides of that. The way she runs, yeah. The way she flops and rolls and jumps. Uh, praise God. All right, friends. Have a great morning. Go walk and get you a little exercise. And quit smoking cigarettes. I love you, friends. Thank you for praying for my sister.